I'm spending from sunrise to sunset in this river mouth to see how many species of fish we can catch for the day. And the reason why I chose this place, because I've heard if you want to catch Mulloway, the Kalgan River is the place to be. Get on. Let him go, let him take it, let him take it, let him take it. Welcome back to another episode. We're in Western Australia and we're in Albany. And even better than that, we're on the Kalgan River right now. And we have the boat in the water, ready to do anything we can. The main target is catching a mulloway. Before we get started, have a look how good this spot is right now, okay? We've got the boat here, as you can see, and my caravan is right there. Just, it just, it works out perfect here, doesn't it? So the tide at the moment is coming back in. Now, a lot of people said to me, Luke, if you want to target, if you want to target mulloway, the incoming tide is where you want to be fishing. So it's the start of the incoming tide, as you can see. And I'll show you where the water goes up, right here. So look how far out has gone. I'll let you watch how we caught the live baits and what we did with them while I get this boat out into some deeper water. We just rocked up at the pier to try and get some trumpeter for live bait, as you know. And check out all these friggin' brim. Look at that. A couple of nice big ones, yeah? So we're after trumpeter today. They're like long with black strips on there. So we're using just squid with a little hook and a little sinker. The wind's so strong, I've got one right in with that small sinker. Hey. All right. <laughs> Lucky. Lucky Tyson's you. Tyson said, hopefully be a um, trumpeter. Trumpeter. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Get him in the bucket. <laughs> Is this good live bait? That's yeah. good live bait, man. Number one, he's good tonight, good too. All right, we've got one trumpeter. We need about three more. Come on, Tyson, get in there, son. Alex is on trumpeter. Oh! <laughs> Bring it here, Al. <laughs> Put him in. Yeah. Get him! Give me some knuckles, 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 knuckles! What is it? Yes, yes, go, go, Tyson! Go, Tyson, don't lose him! Don't lose him! Don't lose him! Legend! Put him in the bucket, Jimmy! Look at that, boys! That's what you want! A nice size, he's got another one! Really <laughs> That's probably size! Look at the size of this thing, man! Show us the brim! The size of this bloody small snapper! Let's measure it! That's it, you can keep that to eat, bro. You can keep it. What are the size? <laughs> See what size it is. Oh, it bit me. Bit more, that's it. 26. You, you can keep it if you want. You keep him. No, I don't, I don't eat back. them pretty fast. Yeah, throw him back. Let him grow. We're pretty set tomorrow, man. We've got enough live bait. We've got the live bait tank. I'm actually going to put the trumpeters in this live bait tank. And then I'm going to go with the boat because the tide comes out really far. So we're going to take the boat out, drive up to the, the five knot pole and tie the rope there with it. You going to open this up. Boop. I'm worried that's going to come off. Look. So I'm going to drill a little hole here and tie a piece of string to that to that. So I did this tide as well, drilled a hole here. Because this turns and I'm worried it's going to open. So if it opens, at least it's like, look at that. They're not going to get through that anyway. This is where I tied the boat up yesterday and the tide was further, was way further back than this. So we're going to let the boat out further than what it is already. We're going to hurry up before these fish die. Give them some fresh water, boys. All right, we're out. We're just going to go here. Beauty. That's still alive? Yep. That's for me. It's not gonna come off. Yeah, all good. Yeah, all good at I don't want to lose the boat. Ugh. Should be all right. All right, that's it. Right knee deep. Gonna be quick when we start this thing. Motor down. Come on, baby. Let's see if we can get it going for a shot. Pump the fuel. Here we go. She's alive. Let's go back. We're up, boys.
So if you watched how we got the live bait, there's the pole right there. And I think it's still there. My concern was last night, someone running over it or, you know, someone taking my live baits. And then we'll punch up to the spot. Throw these live bait in and try start fishing already for Mulloway. Come on, hello there. Yes, it's doing that. Are they alive? All of them are alive, yes, okay. Wagons, ho! Now I can't go fast through here. I'll tell you why. Number one, I'm not experienced in this river. I don't know. There's a rock sticking out over there, right? The tide's coming in. Number two, yeah, I'm just not experienced in here. Is that bait just there, bubbling? What's that there, what's that there? It's like bait or something. It sounds the same. Oh shit, I forgot to do this. I was gonna say, man, it says it's three meters, uh, seven meters here. These fish, look at all the fish. Holy shit, look at them all. Can you see? Oh, look at that mark. Now, Mulloway, I don't know if they sit in deep holes. Look, another mark, look. I don't know if they're fish marks. Oh my godfather. Oh my godfather. Oh my godfather. This is it, boys. We're gonna get on them fish. Oh, shit. Three meters here, boys. Uh, limit. What the hell, the limit of a spear? 10 minutes, we keep moving. 10 minutes, we keep moving. All right, let's see how it's gonna go. Grabbed. You see it there? We need to turn that way, I reckon. Turn us around, we turned. Mm, there's this boy right there. I don't know if it's gonna. We fixed it. This boy's in front of us. I'm worried if I throw my lines out and we get tangled up, if we get something big, then I don't want that. I'll be burning. 3.2 meters under us. Are you guys ready? We're gonna throw in our first live bait of this year. What am I nervous for, man? Running sinker and a nice circle hook. I'm gonna use a pretty okay. straight under its fin. Oh my god, we're doing it! Let's see how it swims, eh? Oh my god, look at that good he swims, man. He's swimming unbelievable. Oh, we did it. First live bait of the water, boys. Keep an eye out for that rod. For the next one, I'm gonna be using a float. It's just a float and a um, and a hook. Put down in the comment section, what should I be doing for live bait for these guys? Am I doing it wrong? Am I doing it right? Let me know. These are the circle hooks that I'm using, if you wanna know. Yeah, are they the right ones? Look, just a float like that. Right, and then we got him there like that. See how that one goes, eh? Keep an eye out for that float. I just worked out why it's pretty shitty. Because the wind's going this way, it's in my back and the tide's coming in. So, it's wind against tide, technically. I'm gonna move an anchor up from the back. Cause it's my lines, look, the float's down there. My lines just wanna go that way with the boat anchored this way. It's no good. We're pretty set up now. We've got the anchor at the back, which, I've never done before, but it's just down there. We just gotta be careful that we've got the rods perfectly. Holy shit, something just jumped. We've got the rods perfectly out the back of the side now, so just gotta sit and wait, boys. Sit and wait. takes that one man, I need one shot, one of these rods to just scream, look what I say I got, that I'm going to put on this hand line, dun 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 dun
I don't know why I sang a Superman song. Throw this bad boy out. Literally in there for 30 seconds and we got cleaned up. They're like piranhas here, man. It's probably a little brim, a little trumpeters too. Very quiet. Don't worry, we'll find them. So I reckon the best time for Mulloway is early morning or late afternoon. So we're hitting midday at the moment, 12 o'clock. They're out here somewhere. We've been at this spot now for what, two and a half hours, not even a bite, nothing. So uh, we're gonna make a move, basically. I'm gonna go back to the caravan because I forgot my bottle of water in the freezer. Grab that, come straight back out. It's gonna be 28 today, so I wanna keep my fluids up in the boat. Gonna drink as much water as we can, boys and girls. Back out, I've got my shower water bottle. Mm. Let's try to catch this mother way. I just got a bit of an intel from a mate. Send me a couple of marks. And he's, look at this, and it's already paying off, boys. I'm gonna go show you what I've just seen. There's Mark, look at this, 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 look at this. We're in a big hole here right now, boys. Oh, I've thrown the rope out, but I'm facing, I wanna face that way. I wanted to, thought I was gonna go back that way, but I might, if we're facing this way, I might have to put it over there. This is no good, this is gonna meet a deep here. You can see the bottom, look. No good, Jimmy. Show you where I want to go. See how it dips? Watch the depth go up. Almost three meters. I don't know if that's just bait fish or mull away. I just got a little. I'm gonna try that. All right, boys, we've got one rod out, another rod out on a float, and a hand line out with a muley. Just the waiting game now. We've got three live bait left in here. This one on this rod's dead. But um, put down the comment section, I've got it on, still dead. Like how I live baited it up. Is that good for mile away or they, it's no good? It's quiet out, out here or I just, don't know what I'm, I just don't know what I'm doing. We've moved again. All right, I'm gonna go right behind the tail this time. Ah, that's it. Look at the difference, how this swim. Look at this, watch. Jeez, get it out. Get it out, get it out, get it out. Two more left, boys. Oh my God, this rod just took off. This rod just took off. Oh my God, guys. Guys, I just got a hit already. What the hell happened? Something had it in its mouth, look. <gasps> oh my God, something had it in its mouth. No. Oh my God, something had it in its mouth. That buckled over and took line, man. You tell me right now what that was. Look at that, look at his scales. It's been smashed. That was a mulloway. That was a friggin' mulloway for sure. That rod buckled. Look at it, look how f***ing battered that thing is, man. Here we go, here we go, here we go. It's on. Here we go. Come on, take it, what's going on? Put it on. Let him go, let him take it, let him take it, let him take it. I just ripped it out of his mouth. I just fucking ripped it out of his mouth. I just ripped it out of his. Oh, I just ripped it out of his. 
fucking mouth. Come on, just one we need. Get it out. We need more fucking live bait. Jesus. I'm gonna catch trumpeter. I gotta set this rod up now and do it. Same thing. Let him go. Let him take it. Come on, swallow it. Swallow it. Swallow it. Tighten it up now. Tighten it up. Tighten it up. Let him take it. Is he taking it? You reckon he's got it, boys? I don't know. to do now it's gone slack what the f is going on my live bait just pulled out lord oh come off last one i don't know how we lost it i don't know something smashed it i didn't i don't know that's it boys and girls this was it. Check that out. Something had this in its mouth, man. I had the hook here. So, what happened? Why then that hook? So, I'll say it again. I'll say it before, boys, and I'll say it again. That's fishing, man. That's fishing. Trumpeter, was it too big? I don't know. I don't know.